Hello everyone! Welcome back to Attack on Titan Season 4 Reaction. We're watching episode 28 of Season 4 today. Before we begin, make the description below. Check out my Patreon, Discord, Instagram, and all that good stuff. What's on Patreon? On Patreon, if you set up for $1, you get early access reactions to Boruto and Pokemon. I thought it backwards this time. Saucy. <laughs> <laughs> and you get early access to those shows, and you can also get a description your name in the description if you're on patreon you lost i'm messing up all messed up now <laughs> <laughs> i'm all backwards now <laughs> you can also get things like early access to other shows as well like dragon ball so check it out you got through it what happened last time on attack on titan um there was lots of fighting i think flock might have died yeah um we might see we might have seen the last of flock his last hurrah maybe I mean, you never know. <laughs> um, they, they're trying to head over to, to go port. get the the boat plane thing, <laughs> the flying boat thing. Yeah. Um, working, so they got to go to this port, and they got to try and get there before Eren gets there, because that's in his path, and yeah. he's coming. He's coming. Oh, Lord, he's coming. <laughs> and, yeah, because they, they're like, we can't, it's going to take us like a day to fix this, mm -hmm. or half a day at best, and they're like, what? Yeah. No. So they couldn't hold them off for half a day, so like, well, we'll take it away. Where they've got better. Where we have better, better, equipment better equipment and stuff, and stuff. So it can be quicker. Yeah, and not have to fight enemy off basically. But they like decimated all those people. There's still more there. Yeah, still there's a few. lot of them there. So they're like, we need to get out of here. Oh, and then they blew up the boat. Yeah, so the, uh, the commanders, commanders both sacrificed themselves to destroy their boat, so they couldn't be chased. Mm -hmm. So they're safe now. Uh, well, safe as in we gotta get them before Aaron does, and fix his plane up, and then go in and fight Aaron basically. Yeah. That's what happened. That's what happened last time. Yep. Are you ready for the next episode? I'm ready. Let's begin! I wonder if we've all got it wrong. Oh, they made it. Oh, oh no, this is when they arrived for the first time. Never uh. mind. <laughs> this is their first time when they left the island, then. It could be that he's always been like this inside. He, he knew but from this, this moment, he already knew he had to crush it. What did I see in him? Can you believe there are really enough people outside the walls to fill up such a gigantic city? <laughs> Try not to talk about the walls in front of the general public, Connie. Uh, right, sorry about that. Get the blend in. The beyond the walls. We're finally here. Outside the walls we've known our whole lives. The walls no one has ever escaped. Would you listen to me for once? <laughs> <laughs> if you think about it. They all look very smart. To the scout's original mission. Right. This was the scout's original mission, which is a scout. They're scouting the outside. <laughs> Let the survey begin. <laughs> Whoa. Film photography. The Titanic is behind them. My friends, I'd like to welcome you to the continent of Mark. The Azuma Vita have been waiting. May I escort you? The continent of Marley. Like <laughs> it's so good to see you all here. So, what does everyone think about the biggest port in the country? Ah, what's with that horse? Or wait, is that what was that? Nah, no horse ever looked like that. <laughs> I think it was a Marley and cow in a car. I've definitely heard about those. Hey! <gasps> they're making a scene. They're gonna look like they're crazy. Wow. <laughs> all these people are gonna think we're a bunch of yokels now. <laughs> Just act like you don't know them. <laughs> <laughs> wow. We get them on a leash. We'll try and feed the crowd carrots if they manage to catch it. Wow. <laughs> Give them more credit. They're gonna feed it carrots. They're buying carrots. They're, They're buying carrots. <laughs> 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 I have no idea what to expect. You're safest at my side. You've really made it across the sea, huh? We're here. I feel bad for him because he's Guys. like. Stick with the group. They don't understand Especially you, what's yeah. going through his head. Be right there. Where he's like, I'm gonna have to kill everybody here. But of course. An ice cream! Woo! Imagine having ice cream for the first time. Sasha, show some restraint. <laughs> How is it cold like that? I wanna try it. I take it this is your first time trying ice cream. What is this is a <laughs> Those idiots. I told them not to draw attention. Hi, little fellow. <laughs> you wanna try it? I'm not a kid. That's so creepy. It 
looks real good. Sharp suit there, bud. Are you and your friends playing gangster? <laughs> He's not a child. Clowns are the worst. Clowns are creepy as heck. I don't think that first belongs to you, does it? No, he knows. <laughs> he used to be you, yeah. Flee! Well, look at that. Another enemy immigrant. How'd you oh. get into Marley? Oh, he's boy. stowed away on a ship. He can't understand us, can oh. he? We can toss him into the sea. Nah, I say we smash his hands. That ought to stop him from picking pockets. Goodness, why people get so violent? Somewhere everyone can see him. Don't hurt him, okay? I got my purse back, so why go that far? Young lady, this is about more than just a purse. All us merchants working in this port are trying to make an honest living. We can't allow the you do honest to violence from our customers. <laughs> On top of that, this kid could be a subject of Ymir. Oh, <laughs> about that. <laughs> like crazy all over during the past few years. Now that we know the devils have been blending in with the rest of us, people are losing sleep over it. Hey, what do you think you're doing? I never said he was a pickpocket. All I said was the purse didn't belong to him. He owes his big sister an apology for this little prank. <laughs> Jeez! Got children for you, but what can you do? Right? It's a family thing! Huh? Oh, yeah! I'm sorry my little brother acted like an idiot, everybody! It smells like bullshit! You think we're stupid? Run for it! <laughs> hey! <laughs> the whole of them, they didn't all need to run, did they? Yeah, well, because they're all, they have to yeah, all stick together, yeah. With improvements in blood testing technology, Countries are beginning to discover that subjects of Emir have been able to sneak out of the internment zones and blend into they the wider population. test your blood, population. and you're like, you're a devil. The bloodline of Emir made its way across Eldian territory when the Empire was at the height of its power, and for many centuries, the ability to trace one's lineage back to a subject of Emir served as proof of noble status among the global elite. You've come to make it known that the people of Paradis wish to coexist in peace? Yes. Good luck. Good luck with that. Because I don't think the world even the wants to even acknowledge that concept. Said goal. Fact is, chances are slim even if we do everything right. Then we'll be in constant danger. But still, we at least have to try. As long as there's a chance, it's our duty to take it. There you go. A true leader. I feel bad for her. It's like, I don't want to... <laughs> I don't want to kill everybody. Aaron! What are you thinking? Did you forget we're undercover in enemy territory and you're their number one target? Everyone's been out looking for you. Is that the boy from the market? Did something happen here? No, nothing yet. What does that mean? Nothing yet. Is this... Mikasa, I need to ask you why you care for me as much as you do. Awkward question. Um, because I saved you back when we were little kids. Or is it more? Because you see me as family. Mikasa. Tell him your feelings. You. Tell him. <laughs> she didn't tell him the truth. Oh. That's nice. I think that was an invitation. Hi! What the hell do you think you're doing, <laughs> maniac? Do you it's think he would have changed on. course if she had told him that she loved him? Perfect timing. Who do you think that would have changed anything? Is that why he was asking? Whoa, Aaron. Yeah, it's alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> you can see the, the, the under their eyes. <gasps> wow. Oh, wow. At least they had a nice time. A nice time before, like, chaos. Time before the storm. <laughs> <laughs> He's smiling, at least. It's like the one time I've seen Aaron happy. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Ah, <laughs> uh, they're asleep. Oh, she's yeah. being sick. Oh, the three friends. 
Ladies and gentlemen, How time this new organization to be. advocates for the subjects of Emir living as refugees around the globe. These desperate people are not responsible for the crimes of the Eldian Empire, but rather its most tragic victims, the island of Paradis, where the Empire's most loyal subjects fled in the wake of Mali's victory a hundred years ago. It is the island devils alone who pose a true threat to humanity. It's not true. That's not true at all. They had no idea about any of this. They were ignorant to it all. That was the day when Aaron truly left us. Later yeah, on, he would send us a letter. He said he was going to leave our futures up to Zeke. But I can't help wondering. When he asked me that question, what if I'd given him a different oh, answer? she thinks the same thing. It's true, because, like, would that have altered... But like, would he have wanted to stay with her then? Right now. If if she knew or if he knew that she I'm loved him. I'm not sure. I think you're a part of Zeke's plan because he believes in you. Please return his faith. For now, I'll pretend to go along with Zeke's plot. Mm. You need to do the same. Yeah, because he, he pretended to be for it. So we play along with him for now. But what happens after that? Why did he choose Flock? I think his Flock was uh, still pushing the same idea. extremist. Mm. They want to turn you into a titan and have you meet Zeke. He would do anything to, to be talked out of it. like complete their plan, fight and he knew free. that. I'll trample it to the ground, the whole outside world, and every person in it. Men, women, children, every last one. That isn't the answer, Aaron. Most of the people out there don't have anything to do with what we've gone through. They would die ignorant and terrified, like your mom. You'll be killing innocent people for reasons they'll never get to know. It's horrible. You're right. But when I'm done, we'll finally be able to break free of the cycle we've been trapped in for 2,000 years. A long history of hate will be buried in the ruins of civilization. The MPs, they plan to make you bear children to be sacrificed for the island. They'll keep forcing children to eat their parents. I won't let them. There was really, like, not many other choices Aaron, they could have done. Please, don't do it. I'll have no choice but to try and stop you. Because if I don't, I'll have to live with the world's blood on my hands. And I can't. I know it's a burden. But if you can bear it till I've got the Founder's power, I'll make you forget you ever knew it was coming. How could I know? Wow. I know you can you're the person who saved my life back in that cavern. Headaches, huh? Well, I doubt there's a connection. There would have to be some genetic illness, but Mr. Saab and Marley's researchers would have made note of that. Our studies do indicate the Ackerman bloodline carries some odd quirks, powers that activate when their survival instincts are triggered. But this theory that she's reflexively guarding her host? To be honest, it seems a little far-fetched to me. It was, and he just used it as a I lie. Think it's far simpler than you're making it, Aaron. She actually loves her. There's straightforward explanations for all the behaviors you're describing that have nothing to do with genetics or conditioning. She doesn't slaughter titans out of some inborn compulsion to keep you alive. She does it because she adores you. She loves him. Hey, Aaron, listen. Well, what do you think you're going to say to her? That's not a serious question, is it? So he had to cut his leg off. Can you imagine doing that? My life's ended to set, but my friends will keep living long after I'm gone. And then his eye, he has to take his eye as well. Guns ever manufactured have been gathered from across the globe here today off the coast of Marley. 
The combined brain power of the world's nations is focused entirely on resolving this shared crisis from this rumbling. Oh my goodness, I'd be so scared. Here they come! How fast are they traveling? Are they under the sea? Yeah, they're, I think they're under the water. Just keep firing. I would just keep going. Oh, they're swimming. Why are they swimming? <laughs> 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 they look tiny, <laughs> swimming around. Like little whales. I thought they would have just been walking under I the water. I thought they walk. I mean, I guess they can destroy a few. I mean, there's really way no too many. Look at that, though. Keep going, keep going. Oh lord, it's done. It's too many. The original music. Oh, from the heat. It's done. Now they're standing up. It's done. You can't do anything now. It's not even worth fighting. It's the only thing you can do. But you can't you can't outrun them. There's Aaron. Is that what him? is he now? It can only be the attack Titan. Why is he so huge? He's enormous. He's bigger than them. Yeah, he's is... he's gigantic. How is he this big now? I'll kill them all. Why does he look like that now? I have no idea. I mean, that's not even a titan, that's just a, an abomination. <laughs> the end. <laughs> <laughs> well, there you go. The last episode of the final season of part two. <laughs> <laughs> we basically got to see how everything that yeah, led up to... Yeah, sort of flashbacks. Yeah, everything that led up to what's happening. I don't think Mikasa saying something different would have made a difference. Because I think he knew. And I think that it is the reason he's doing this. Because he knows that she loves him. He knows he can't be with her because he's only got a few years left. And I think he thinks he'd rather she just lives a long life. And he thinks he's saving his friends, I think. He's doing. He is doing this all for them, you know, mm -hmm. in a very twisted yeah. way. He's doing it so they can live long, happy lives, mm -hmm. and he's sacrificing his own heart essentially because he doesn't want to do this. He obviously does not want to do this at all. He's crying. He looks depressed, you know, and everything. And he's like, "Well, what's happened here? Nothing yet." It's like in a way, I think she gave him the answer that's led him to do this, like. Maybe if she'd have been like, oh, I see you as a brother. He'd have been like, well, screw you then. What am no. I doing all this for? No. <laughs> he cares about them, you know. Yeah. But I think he knew. I think her answer was clear Was not going to change anything. Yeah, because you could see on her face. Mm -hmm. You're, you're and Zeke told just family. Because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. he was like, he thought she has headaches and she's trying to protect me because um, I have the founder within me. Mm -hmm. And it's like, no. He's like, I, that's a bit far of a stretch. I think, you know, all of the, all the symptoms that you're saying mm -hmm. is because she adores you. And it's like, it's true. It, it is that way. And she was caring about him before he even had Titan abilities. Mm -hmm. um, it was kind of cool. To, I guess it was nice to see them have one last happy moment <laughs> before all the chaos. Uh, and seeing Aaron cutting his leg off and his eye, like when he was undercover, essentially. Uh, and Marley trying to get information and get close to Zeke and stuff. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> it's crazy. I feel like I've missed why he looks like this now. Why does he look like a weird abomination? Oh, you mean... Like a skeleton. I think the forms change whenever they do something crazy. So, like, it was... Remember that abomination from the... Uh, when that royal family guy, like, drank some Titan fluid or licked it off oh, the yeah. floor? And then mm -hmm. he turned into this giant mm -hmm. abom abomination mm -hmm. that's just, like, crawling on the ground. Mm -hmm. He's basically... He had his head cut off. Mm. So his head was over he, here, yeah. and then when he touched Zeke, he absorbed Zeke, and then transformed where the spine mm -hmm. like connected, and mm -hmm. it just, I think he, because he's combined with so many now, he has mm -hmm. Zeke. So he does have Zeke's power now. So. Yeah, he has Zeke's power, because he absorbs Zeke into him. Mm -hmm. He has the Warhammer Titan, the, the Attack Titan, and the Founding Titan. Right. He has like four Titans now within him, mm -hmm. and I think when he had his head cut off and stuff, that's why his head is kind of like dangling. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. On this skeletal like spine thing, I think it, it all of that combined. I think made him into this. It looks awful. <laughs> he looks like the devil, like Satan up there, over. And I think he made it's himself huge. big enough to where he can basically oversee all the colossals, and he can just kind of be there to like follow them. And the thing is, it's also the fault of these people who he's killing. You know, the people that were all if he was seeing devils. if he was seeing a different. A different uh, a th a feelings from them. Mm -hmm. Like if he saw them being like, you know, it's maybe not their we shouldn't... fault. You know, it was a hundred years ago that the people who were born today didn't don't have blood on their hands. Mm -hmm. They don't know what happened. And then even at first, when that guy was giving the speech, um, it made it sound like he yeah. cared about the Mar the Eldians but there. They're, like they're just victims. Like, but it's the ones on the island. The ones on the island, though, are the ones that we need I to get rid of. And, and it's then he's like, like okay. <laughs> That's how it's gonna be. That's then. it. That's it. It decided. You know, he's like, we we've been here. They were there for like a few years, I think, mm -hmm. and nothing was changing. No. They were trying to get people to to get rid of that hate, and he's like, it's not working. I've given you guys your chance to fix it. It's not being fixed. I have to do what I need to do now, and that's that's what, what he's doing. doing. And he's killing everybody. That that they had the world fleet, the entire world's fleet. That's too big. Destroyed in like seconds. And then they swam under, they like really a swim. swimming. <laughs> swimming underneath, little legs flapping. I assumed they were so big that they would walk on the bottom of the, of the ocean. Once they got to the shore, mm -hmm. then they stood up and they were like, then they looked proper that big is again. crazy. But when they went, when that one swam underneath the ship and just the heat itself disintegrated the people on the ship, it was like how, because I, I heard some people like, wouldn't you just like, just try to aim like between their feet and not get crushed? Like I was the heat thinking that. The heat itself, we would disintegrate. Yeah. I was thinking, that's okay, but not when there's so many. I mean, I guess they're slow, but like... Well, when I you mean, saw the aerial shot. Their feet are so huge as well. Like, it's not just like a little dodge. Like, they're <laughs> huge feet, you know? Because <laughs> when you show, when it showed the aerial shot of all of them, mm -hmm. there was so many, so many in a group. And they're just, so huge. Is, is, is the, is already, and they've already made, he made landfall. So it's it, they're already behind like it's oh they're already like working against the clock now mm -hmm. is the uh, Mikasa and them like they're having to fix this plane and stuff that he's made landfall so the longer they take the more people that are gonna die and get crushed and Historia didn't want this either no she was like this is not this is not the answer I don't want even all these Flock people. was like <laughs> you sure bro <laughs> but he was just, he was such a fanatic I think Aaron used that to his advantage yeah. Uh, but but uh, Historia was like, no, this is wrong. Like, I don't want all their blood on my hands. If you're doing that, I'll erase your memory. <laughs> so, She's like, that's so. not the point. <laughs> <laughs> that's not the way. It's, like, it's the only way, because they'll keep. They'll basically continue the lineage of having children, having the children be eaten, and becoming titans, and then it just continues it mm -hmm. forever and ever and ever. And that's what's been going on all this time. And he's like, I'm ending it. It's all being ended now with this. And it's just a crazy way to go about it. I like when uh, Aaron was thinking about, like, when did it all begin? Like, when did this all mm. start? It? And at the end there, when he was crushing them all, it showed when his mom was eaten. Mm -hmm. And, it goes and back it's like, to that. that is when that was the moment where he's like, I'm going to kill them all. I'm going to destroy all. And that's what he was saying. I'm going to kill them all. He was repeating the words he said back then. Mm -hmm. But back then he was saying it to about the Titans. Uh, the Titans. Which was the enemy, mm -hmm. but now these are the enemies. Like I'm gonna kill them all. <laughs> it's like that's where it all started, and 
I guess. If only he'd moved to Pokemon to catch them all. It would have been what much kind of more gentle this? show. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to kill them all, I'm going to catch them all. That then it a... would have been a nice gentle show. <laughs> Everyone would have been happy. No. You could have captured all of them. No. You could have just captured all of them. <laughs> Kept them in a little basement somewhere. Uh, <laughs> or a big basement. A big basement. <laughs> It's going to be a, a crazy final, final part of this show. Yeah. I'm annoyed that we don't just get it now. Like, I feel like it's dragging it out mm -hmm. again. It, yeah. Especially but... to have three parts. I can see I feel parts. like this should have been the finale of season four. Next season should have been season five. And season five should have been the final season. Mm-hmm. Oh, they could have ended it somewhere halfway between this, like, this one and three. The... They could have just had two that were, like, you know. One and a half of each, season yeah. four, season five. Because calling it the final season and then being, like, part one, part two, part and three. And not coming and out like, at stop. the beginning and saying this is part one. Like, I don't know. I they, should like have been, they should have been forward with us from the beginning. Like, there's going to be three parts. <laughs> This is part one of the final season. Then it would have been like, okay. It we feels know. a bit false advertising. Yeah. <laughs> but we will watch. We will watch it. It eventually comes back, which we've got to wait a while. I think January is when it comes out in sub, so we'll have to wait a bit longer for the dub a month or so, usually is what it takes. Um, but that's supposedly the climb, final, the final, final, final arc. Final, 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 final. <laughs> which I can see it now. Like, what else is there? We have I don't to know. Fight. <laughs> we have to fight Aaron. We can drag it out some more. <laughs> no. But yeah, it was. Uh... And they're like, then there's a movie. <laughs> <laughs> no, stop. We keep going. Did you enjoy? Yeah. Hopefully, everyone else enjoyed. Like and subscribe if you did. And as always, have a great one.